Would you want to leave this place where we grew up? This old town, just put it all behind. Remember you and I would always find someone. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm so excited to show you guys another space makeover. We are making over the back door area where we hang our keys and our coats. We needed a space for that stuff, so we made it over, added some hooks and some cool design elements. I'm excited to show you everything that we did. We also got a new table for our dining room area. If you watched a couple of uh, videos back, I mentioned that I wanted a new top for my table because the pendant we got for over the table didn't I didn't like the way it looked with the wood table so we got a new tabletop for that and I'll show you how we made that space over as well but I am super excited to share another space makeover with you guys in our new house and I hope you guys enjoy we got a lot going on here so a few videos back I mentioned once we put this pendant light up over our dining table I didn't like the wood and I wanted to do a marble top and I found one. It is currently upside down. It's very heavy. But I found one on Facebook Marketplace for $50. It was originally part of a coffee table. I'll post a picture of what the coffee table looked like. Well, this isn't the prettiest, but the marble is really pretty. So we're going to glue that on the original base of our dining table. And then we're going to do this wall. So this is our back door, our kitchen. We're going to do board and batten on about three quarters of the wall and then wallpaper on the rest. And I'm going to show you guys the process of that. And we are finally getting to this little spot where I think it's in the first video I showed you guys. There was a fireplace originally here. We just have to put the flooring down. So we're going to do that as well. When I need some love and baby Got a dopamine rush, got a major league crush when you're next to me Got my heart up on my sleeve, can I hide the way I feel when you're next to me, girl? Why do we 
It's never had Dovetail by Sherwin Williams. Beautiful. It's a nice warm gray brown color. I'm so excited. This is also going to be the color of all of the interior doors. So the born batten will be this color, and then this door will be this color on the inside, and then all the other doors like this door and then the front door will be and you know all the other doors will be this color as well so i'm going to start painting i assume we'll probably take two coats so. Very simple and neutral. It's just gonna go 
above, over top of this door, and on the other side here, stopping at the edge of the cabinet. Because we're going to do a backsplash in the kitchen, but I didn't want to stop up there because I thought that would look weird. So, I have my tools. I have like a little, I guess, um, straight edge to smooth out the wallpaper and a razor. And I just have a bigger scraper thing to help put the wallpaper on. And we will see how this turns out. I think the hardest part is going to be matching the pattern. And I think I'm going to start here and work my way that way. And then go back that way, I think. Let's see. Show you what a good time looks like You can't do better, so much better
Alright, now the harder part is going to be matching. Now the harder part is going to be matching the pattern. Oh my gosh, it looks so good. Okay, so this is the final 
product of the marble top. As I'm sure you can see, we struggled. I mean, it's heavy, guys. So we had to glue a base onto this. And I just got this round wooden piece from Lowe's. And I think they have a size bigger than this. But it actually turned out really good. These arms were the original like brace for this table but when I looked up how to like I guess adhere the marble to the base it said to flip the marble upside down and put the base on top of it and these arms did not lay flush they're a little wobbly so I decided to get this round piece just to give it a little more of a brace um, so you can see here there's I don't know if you can tell, but there's a little bit of a space between that. But we screwed the original base onto the round thing, and then we just glued the round wooden base to the marble. And then I finished. Oh, there's a big space at the top of the door. A big I'm why, just now noticing that. That's Maybe why, that's why it's so warm over here. That's why Dominion is getting all of our money. <laughs> <laughs> um, so I finished the wallpaper. I ran out of wallpaper, so I'm going to do down this <gasps> side as well. But I came over here. It was really easy to match up the pattern because the pattern repeated so much. But when I got over here to this part, I ripped it. So I had to... I put a little piece here and you can't really tell at all because the pattern is really nice. But this little piece right here is what I cut off to match it because otherwise there wouldn't be anything there. But that caused me to lose, yeah, that caused me to lose a pattern. So I had to skip a pattern to do the rest, which in the end it caused me to have less to finish it. So I'm gonna have to get another roll. But it was really easy to match up. And then of course I got hooks to put on this because this is essentially where we're gonna hang our coats and bags. And then I have an idea for a bench. This is just temporary. I might paint this on a different color, probably black or something like that. But I have an idea for a bench, which will be another video. And then I'm also going to paint this door the same color as the Born Batten. But it looked really good. It was so easy, guys. I did it by myself, except for one in this corner. I had Scott help me a little bit. I don't know how much help another person would actually be, but... She did it herself. <laughs> it was really easy. I do recommend, if you do this, to get a pattern on a wallpaper that is pretty repetitive. Although this is the first time I've ever done it, so I don't know how other patterns would do, excuse me, would do, but it turned out really well. And it looks so good with our marble top table and our folding chairs that will eventually be replaced. But it looks really, really nice so far. Okay, so I got the hooks in that are going, you see them? Um, on my wall back here they're super simple i'm just going to go in between each board up high so i'm going to mark where they are going and i'm going to just screw them in and the good thing is they came with screws that are already black but if you don't have screws that match your hardware i guess i always paint them um, cause it's hard to find, oh, I guess it's not hard, but, oh well. It's easier to find the normal silver screws if your stuff doesn't come with the screws. So I would just paint them whatever color they are. But these came with the black screws, so we're good.
felt I'm done with the defense Throw back and climb over your fence Hide to show, show you that I was a mess So you were shrugging your shoulders I'm closed off, that's what I told you Soon enough, everything started to change Cause there's no going back no going back, there's no going back to your own life Not living in the past, we're over that I'm feeling it tonight, riding on the deep Wallpaper is actually from Wall Pops, and I will link that down below. I've also found a great peel and stick wallpaper source. It's called Love versus Design. I will also link that down below. I wish I had found this second website before this because I do love a lot of their um, patterns on their wallpaper. But with this being peel and stick wallpaper, I can change it anytime I want. So I'm excited to maybe change it in the future. I'm sure I will because. That's just who I am. But I hope you guys enjoyed it. Like always, don't forget to like and subscribe below. And I will keep you guys updated on what is next. And I'm also going to add some photos at the end of this video of some houses that we have staged here recently. I'm excited to show you that as well. We have a bunch of room design and stagings coming up soon. So I'm excited to share everything with you guys. I hope you all enjoyed. I will see you guys next time.